What? Natch box with sugar. Okay. Oh, ha, 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 ha. welcome back to uh, Dracula 2 Last Sanctuary. We're gonna use a matchbox with the sugar, apparently. And that's. We caught a fly! Also, I wasn't too off. Okay, so we weren't supposed to catch food for Hopkins. Okay. Okay. Where's my food? Oh, wait, is it this one? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Hello. Mmm, delicious. This fly is a real treat. Hopkins, what happened to Mina and Dr. Seward? Tell me. So you know my name. There's no need to introduce myself then. I've been dying to meet you. Let's dispense with the formalities. I've got to know what happened here. You're not in a position to demand anything. All you need to know is that the Master considered that the good Dr. Seward had become somewhat bothersome. And Mina? Madam Mina... The, 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 the Master wants her. He... She's with him. Yes, she's with him. Okay. Um... Here, have a bottle. Am I done? Guess so. Oh god! Are you going to attack me or...? I'm not even holding the cross. Oh, whoa, Jonathan. Okay, sure, why not? Just leave the let's just leave the vampire there. That works. Oh, did I kill him? With what? I don't know. Okay, now we have a needle full of vampire blood. Why not? What? what? Oh. So I, I'm, I'm guessing I'm supposed to leave now. I did like that the fly was making noise and that was your meant to be a cue that like that you needed to um, trap the fly. I mean it was still terribly done but like that part was pretty clever. So now what? We have a key. Key of laboratory. How do I get to the laboratory? Maybe I was supposed to just stay. Maybe the laboratory was down there as well then and I should have just not walked away all the way up. That was probably my bad. This game is Really tricky to navigate. I know it's. I know I said that about the first game, but um, the way the game just turns you around involuntary is really, really annoying. So wait, so it's this door then. What? Okay, maybe not. Oh. What does it want from me? Oh, matches. No. Uh, the blood first, maybe.
No? The bottle first? Okay, the bottle. Good. And um, then the needle? Yes. Um, then the flame. No. Okay, uh, the bottle again. Yes, and then the flame. That was kind of a puzzle. Okay, so I now have anti vampire lotion. Did I read that right? Anti vampire lotion. Anti vampire lotion. Are you dead? Yeah, so I can't use the anti vampire lotion. You're not a vampire anymore. Okay. Sure. Why not? You want to say anything to me? Hopkins. Look. I'm armed to fight Dracula. Dracula. Help me to save Mina. You've seen her. You see how vulnerable she is. But to save Mina would mean betraying the master. I cannot act against the master. But I can't leave Mina in danger either. What a terrible dilemma. I've already beaten Dracula. Trust me. And together, we can save Mina. It'll take more than words to convince me. I know that you possess the dragon's ring. If you want me to trust you and help you, give it to me. That way you can let me be the judge of how sincere you are. What? Oh my fucking god, Jonathan Harker! Change. Here are my spectacles. They will be extremely useful to you because they may come and mortal see with a secret vision of the vampires. The master is right to be wary of you. You're a brave man. I shall help Mina. What? How did any of that make any sense? We have anti-vampire lotion, we gave the dragon ring to one of the patients, and we got vampire vision goggles in return. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I'm coming. I Silence. In a little while, everything that is yours will be mine. Then your life will be worth no more than that of an insect, and I shall simply flick you away. Uh, okay, Dracula. I'm sorry, Doracula, because apparently we're pronouncing you in Katakana now. Very confusing game. Just now I'm done here, right? I can leave. Right. No. Okay. Hopkins glasses. Anti vampire lotion. Right. Maybe I'm supposed to walk down into the sewers again. Nope. Okay, I'm going I'm going to go back into the office because I probably missed something here now that after Dracula was called. That may be a book. No, no book. Oh, there's nothing here, so back into the laboratory we go, I guess. I love running back and forth. I was supposed to tell Hopkins that Dracula literally just called us on the phone and was like, ha, well, Lucy, you are. Nope, we can't talk to Hopkins. Okay, fine. I miss Empress Palpatine. She was funny. Oh no, he's gone. Somehow. Oh, we're back in the sewers. Glorious. Oh, now we can walk here. Oh, 
Forest Vampire Night Vision. Seriously? Okay. Wait, shit. Oh no. Uh anti vampire lotion. No. How about a gun? No. Uh where did my crucifix go? Uh anti vampire vision. Oh, oh, he has a a wound. Can I shoot it now? No. Uh anti vampire lotion's on the bullets. Really? And he's gone. So now I have an anti-vampire gun. Yeah, anti-vampire's gun. Amazing. An anti-vampire's gun. Now if only they had that in the original Dracula story. Would have solved so much... Oh, I was supposed to walk back. Wait, where am I? What? I'm so confused. Hello? Oh, it's Dracula! Um. He doesn't seem to ha be happy to see us. Um. Mina. Are those the stairs from the first game? Mm, I don't think so. So is this just like a doll or something then I guess? Yeah, I mean I would explain the box feet. I don't know, I, w I, w I wouldn't have been surprised if we had books foot bo box foot vampires at this point. Makes about as sense as anything else, really. What? Really? Am I not supposed to use the organ thing here? Wait, well, hold on. Yeah, that's fine, but. There's like a little black markings there. What's that about? Okay, I'm going to guess that we're not ready to do something here yet. <sighs> nope, there's definitely something I'm supposed to do here. I'm not sure what. Notebook. No. The other notebook. No. I mean, it should be an organ portion. This is an organ. Oh. Oh no, the box vampire was real. It looks as if our little troublemaker is coming along. The game is over. This weapon can no longer save you. You're at my mercy. What do you want? You can see for yourself. You are in my castle in Transylvania, and you can expect no one to help you. You've lost. Now tell me where the ring is, and I shall be merciful. Where is Mina? Mina is no longer any of your business, but I'm prepared to spare your life if you give me the ring. That's a fool's bargain. People mean nothing to you. I know that the ring can destroy you. Without it, you're nothing more than a puppet hanging on its last string. I shall never tell you where it is. Me? A puppet? How dare you speak to me like that? Wow, he's Donald Trump. Your tiny mortal brain hasn't quite grasped the importance of what's going on. The world will soon be nothing more than a shadowy garden people with slaves over which I shall rule with Mina at my side. What a pity you won't live long enough to see my triumph. 
in a few moments, life as you know it will cease to exist. You will become one of those beings you'd so vainly fought against. There could be no more miserable fate than Jonathan Hawkers. So, how did we get back to Transylvania? Hopkins. So it's you who's in charge of the dirty work. I might have known. Don't make your situation any worse than it already is by talking rubbish. Think about it. If I had betrayed you, the ring would be in Dracula's hands now, rather than in the protection of St. George in the cemetery where I've put it. Now I have to leave before the master notices my absence. Ben, be careful. Beyond that door, there is danger everywhere. Well, am I not in Trans I thought Dracula said we were in Transylvania now. Yeah, this is the castle from the first game. How did we get here? We were in London. Um... So we're apparently in Transylvania in Dracula's bedroom from the first game now because you know Transylvania is just right next to London, I guess. And oh shit, this is not. Oh, it was a stage. Well, we have. Oh no, the we need to make the. There we go. Okay, so there we go, and then we ah. The empty vampire's gun. <sighs> Which is still just beyond amazing. It's an actual thing. I'm gonna go over here first. Seward. Oh, Seward's a vampire now? Okay. Sure. Why not? Oh, oh, it's the box vampire. It actually is a mechanical Dracula. What the? Wow, okay. Really? This game is awesome. What the? What's happening? at him. Also, how come I don't have a health bar here of all places? I'm guessing I'm supposed to pull that thing, but the game is having some frame rate troubles right now. If you can't tell. Normally I would edit this, edit this out, but you know what? Fuck this game. Hi, Dracula. Okay. Why does Dracula have a mechanical version of himself? This game would be much better if it was more self-aware about how incredibly silly it is. Now what? Oh, further up. Okay. See, the problem with adventure games that, does, that do these sort of just use whatever item you find on whatever thing is that I have no contextual reason for believing this stuff would work. Um, it's Puzzles are better, much better, if they come out of a place of aha I should do this and then try and do it here it's more what the mechanical Dracula has a key finger or something what what is happening um but yeah like I'm just clicking until something happens here rather than thinking okay 
what would be the contextual reasonable way to solve something? And that's an example of a bad uh, adventure game right there. And of course, of course I'm using adventure game in the classic term of what people now would just call a point-click adventure, although that's supposed to be specifically for games where you point and click. And there are adventure games where you don't point and click, obviously. Well, now what? Oh. Okay. So we're in a, now we're in an event system. Why not? That actually reminds me of... Um, I watched the new Five Nights at Freddy's game. Um, I've never played any of the series. I'm not really interested in them. Uh, I thought 3 looked kind of interesting, but... Um, but I was watching the uh, someone played the latest one, and I was kind of surprised that they've. It seems they've sort of evolved the game from originally being about sitting in a place, clicking about, trying to stay alive, until the new version, which has you actually walking around like an like a point-to-click adventure game. It seems to be somewhat on rails, but even so, like that was a pretty cool. I thought it was a cool way to evolve the concept to sort of make it a mist-like in a way. Because um, I, I often feel that horror games are almost done the best in when they're done as first-person uh, point-to-click adventures. Like Some of the scariest memories I have of video games are from games like Morpheus, uh, which is a... Uh, really good first-person horror game that I'm actually kind of surprised I didn't play for Halloween now that I think about it. That game actually uses FMV as well, and it uses, uh, uses FMV, <laughs> oh, that's great, it uses FMV, um, okay, now what, oh, okay. It uses FMV live action stuff, rather than the CGI like this does. And it has ghosts, and you're on a frozen ship, and it has human experiments. It's it's really cool. It, I like it a lot. Uh, if you haven't played Morpheus, I think it's from ninety five or ninety six, maybe. No, no, it's later than that. It must be ninety eight. It must be ninety eight. Um, uh, do check it out. I don't know if it's on GOG or anything. It should be, but Yeah, you never know um, about if games are on GOG or not, if they should be. So now what? Um, oh, it's... Steward. I thought it was a vampire now. It's too late for me, but there's still hope for Mina. Now go and destroy Carfax. There is a secret passage behind the organ. It opens when you press on one of the keys. When you are safe, I shall destroy everything here. That way the monster will have nowhere to hide. Jonathan, give me your pistol. Take this key. It opens my laboratory at the asylum. We've already been, Use the been there. Use the results of my research to save Mina. Sword. I... I know. Me too, my friend. Me too. That was so a confession of love. Uh, okay, so... Whatever, um... Are we just going to leave now? Going to go back to Carfax? How will we go back to Carfax? This is all so confusing. Oh, we can do something here again. Okay. Oh, of course. Where should I use the tuning fork? That was a tuning fork, right? Yeah, it's a tuning fork. So where do I use it? Not here then. Okay. Oh, 
the vampire vision seems rather odd in how it works. Oh no. Did really need to use the the vampire anti vampire gun for that? I kind of liked my anti vampire gun. Seward, my dear friend, my physical suffering is only equaled by the pain in my heart. Your death must be the last on a list which is already too long. Once I have destroyed Carfax. Dracula will have no choice but to take refuge in his sanctuary at Highgate. Then I shall draw the monster from his lair and kill him. Your sacrifice will not have been in vain. I pray that you will hear my vow, wherever you may be. There we go. Uh... So how are we going to destroy Carfax, I wonder? Was this the door that he meant? No. Oh, what's this? Crates. Okay. Bunch of items. Because we can't go outside anymore, that at least that narrows down our our options, that's good. There's nothing here. Need a tool, okay. So that tool. No. The tuning fork. No. This is the hammer. Oh, okay. Sure. Why not? Not like it makes less sense than before. Oh, we grabbed the candle again. Cool. So are we just going to burn down the house? Is that the idea? That would actually make that would actually make contextual sense. How are we going to arrange a big fire like that though? Oh the coffin. Yes. Okay. Uh so the hatchet? Yes. This door still bugs me. Like, what is what am I supposed to use it for? Am I supposed to gather even more planks, or can I just like combine these planks? No. I don't light the candle. Um, I still use the clippers, so I'm guessing that's where I still need to use, but I'm not sure where I would use it. Oh, wait, I, I can still go up uh, there, right, I haven't been there yet. To the edge of the um, thing here, or the balcony. Maybe I can use it here. Nope, of course not. So I'm guessing I missed something here after all. There's a bunch of planks here, why can't we take those? Assuming we are supposed to burn the place down though, but that seems like the logical conclusion I've come to from what we're doing. Since we're gathering planks in Dracula's sanctuary. One of his sanctuaries. It's funny how it's called the last sanctuary when we've been to two out of three sanctuaries in the game so far. Nope. There really is nothing else here. Did 
Did we check the chest? No, we can't do anything there. Okay, well, that must be all we can do here then. So now we need to go back to the basement and... I'm not sure, actually. But, I mean, that's the only place left that we could do something. I guess, unless we can go outside now. Nope. I'm gonna equip the planks. Okay, so now what? Can't use the planks here. Still can't open this door. So are we supposed to leave? We I mean, can't leave either. Uh... Oh! Was that there before? Okay, well now we've used all the tools. Oh, Peabody's gone. In fact, I can't move anywhere. Oh. Now I can. Oh wait, yeah, we, oh, we, we fought Peabody, didn't we? He was one of the first vampires we used the... Uh, we, he, he was the one we um, used the stake on, wasn't it? Okay, oh, now it's time. Uh, planks. No. Um, cloth. Okay, cool. Planks. No. Candle. No. The other planks. Oh, okay, I'm sorry. I had to use the planks in a certain order, of course. All your attempts to harm me are so pathetic. I tell you that nothing you can do will prevent my union with Mina. I condemn you to be burnt alive in this hell. Okay. Well, that sort of backfired, didn't it? That. Think. Oh. Click. Think. Oh, a key. Good job, Dracula. You somehow just forgot to take the escape key. God, this... This Dracula is the worst vampire villain ever. Um, okay... Oh, maybe we need to have night vision. And then we go for a swim. Something here. At least there's no breath meter or anything. That's good. That would have been annoying if you had to deal with that as well. Considering how fast the health goes down during the combat sequences. Okay. Do we have any tools? Not really. Oh. <laughs> wow, that was easy. Man. How the hell Dracula hasn't managed to kill me yet is... You know, that's a question for the ages. 
considering how useless I am. Nothing here. Then again, he's pretty useless too. Like, we're kind of a perfect match for each other in a way. Um, I guess we'll go in here. It's locked. Oh, this is the key to the laboratory. The other laboratory key. Uh, okay, sure. We did a thing, I guess. No? Oh, we need an item. Tuning fork! Haha! -ha. Anti vampire's waves box. Are you fucking kidding me? Anti vampire's waves box. Okay. Okay, so now what do I. I guess I'm going back to the cemetery or. I don't even know. This is all so confusing. And then once again it turns me around, which is just baffling. Okay, so I'm not supposed to go to the uh, graveyard yet, because that was the way to the graveyard. Where am I supposed to go then? This, the game is so bad with signposting, it's ridiculous. Maybe I should go down in the other sewer, sewer path this time. Nope, not that either. So, like, what the stair? Oh, they wanted to go through the laboratory sewer, even though that led to the theater. Okay, sure. Why not? Whatever. Gotta say, I liked the first game more. It was funnier. Not intentionally, but, you know. Since it had less areas to walk through, it was a bit less confusing to navigate. Can I walk in the right way? I don't know. No, this was the way to... Uh... Oh, maybe it works this way too as well. I don't know. The arrows are working, so maybe, maybe it'll be fine. I'll just keep on clicking the arrows. Didn't we blow this place up? Hey, Seward. I thought you... Did you really fail to blow up the place? You... You shot these and they exploded. You're terrible at this. Um... Guess we'll use the vampire mission again? Click that again. What did this do again? All oh, right, the boat. Seward, my dear friend. It's the same cutscene. My physical suffering is only. But wait, what? How did I? I. <laughs> I just looped back around. Good job, game. Good fucking job. Good job, me too, for not realizing it until way too late that I was looping around. That is incredible. That's just amazing. <sighs> okay. Well, um... So let's see. It was... 
this way and then... No! What? But... If this is the only way I can walk, then how am I supposed to get to... Oh, can I, oh, can I, can I leave through here? No! But... Then... What? I am so confused right now. Am I not supposed to go to the cemetery and destroy the last sanctuary? Was that not the plan? Oh. Oh, I guess I did something. Oh, I guess I changed the pathways. Okay, well, fine, whatever. Oh, okay. You know... Jonathan, there's a thing called... Walking through the streets of the city. That you could have tried if you wanted to do these things. You're saying... Oh, hey, it's the... It's this old thing. Wait, what? Oh, oh yeah, this was the way out. Right, okay. Hey, we're here again. Thank <laughs> you. 